Hey y'all, what's up? I'm Everything Track. So, yesterday I made a video called Tina Daniels is a Fraud, and it is almost at 10k views. I didn't think it was going to blow up. I didn't think it was going to get big like that. Like, out of nowhere, I went from zero views to 20 views to 50, which is normal, to when I'm waking up and it's 8k views, and I was like, what the heck? So, the video was about Tina Daniels and her 1083. Now, some people were in the comment section. Obviously, I don't think they, I don't think they really watched the video. I said in the video that Tina Daniels hit a 1083, but it was last year. That's why I was calling her a fraud because she was using last year's times. But I saw some of my loyal subscribers, like people that are actually subscribe to me that I talk to on a daily basis, say that you could use times from July of last year or June of last year, and I didn't know that. So I just looked it up. I just I just kind of woke up, um, and I just looked at it. So let's go over it for people that also don't know. All right, so the 2022 guidelines, all qualifying performances for the championships must be attained on a standard outdoor track in the period Tuesday, June 1st, 2021 through Sunday, June 12th, 2022. So I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I mean, the video was never um, – the video was never a lotto because I never said that she never ran the 1083 because some of y'all were in the comment saying section saying that, but y'all obviously didn't watch the video. I literally said in the video that she ran a 1083, but it was last year's times. I just personally didn't know that you could use last year's times to a certain extent, which is June. So I didn't know that. So Tina, Tina, uh, I think this video is going to get <laughs> a whole lot bigger than I thought it was going to get, though, the first one. So, uh, Tina is not a liar. I just didn't know that you couldn't um, use Tom's from June of last year. Now, I'm still not changing my opinion on that, though. I still think you shouldn't use Tom's from last year if you haven't hit close to those times. Like, your best time, like, her best time is still a 1099. That's nowhere close to 1083. And, uh, and you also, for people that say that they register, no, the person that wants to run registers themselves in there. I mean, their agent might do it as well, but they still have to um the agent still follows under that runner. Like the the agent can't just put whatever they want to put in there. So like the runner still has to tell them what to put in. Or the runner themselves can put themselves in. Like you like because there's a lot of runners that are fast that aren't in the qualifying list. Like Joseph Fambley, for example, he should be in there, but he's not because he didn't put himself in there. You have to put yourself in there. Your agent puts yourself in there. There's no day that puts yourself in the track meet. And, uh, I saw that too. So, yeah, it's just a follow-up video. So, I didn't know that, but uh, it is what it is. So, I'll just let y'all know that. that uh, now that now, now we all know that you can use times from June of 2021. I mean, I still don't agree with it. I still think you should use times from 2022 because those are most current and more most up-to-date. But I'm not the president of the person that makes the cat launch, so it is what it is. But anyways, I'll see y'all later, all right? Peace.